Hello Sagittarius, welcome back. We are Twin Oracles back again with your today's tarot card reading. This is a timeless reading, Sag, so whenever you find this video, that's when it's meant for you. That's when it will most resonate with you. Thank you all so very, very much for being here. Thank you all very much for liking our video. Um, it doesn't cost you anything and it means the world to us. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you for being part of our channel, Twin Oracles, and for subscribing. With that being said, Sagittarius, I was picking up a channeled message for you. Um, what was it? It just slipped my mind now. What was that message? Oh yes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's funny. The message was that there's something hidden, Sag. And it's funny that the message was actually hidden from me. I couldn't even remember. It was trying to hide, okay? So that's never happened before. Um, Saj, there's something here that is trying to hide, lurking deep within the waters, lurking deep within your subconscious, lurking deep within your emotions, okay? And that's for you to pick up on and for you to divulge and to dive into, okay? Saj, take that time out to figure out what's trying to hide from you, what's lurking in those deep emotional waters, deep within your subconscious, okay? There could be something you're scared of. Something is trying to, um, maybe maybe you're scared and you're trying to um, push it down. You're, you're, you don't want to deal with it, so you try to escape from it or you, you're into a, a habit or, you know, a toxic behavior or something, some sort, some shape, some form, okay? It doesn't matter, Sagittarius, but there's something you're scared of, essentially, and it's like you're running from it, okay? So just take that time, Sag, um, to figure out what this is. Try to place this in your life. Try to bring it to life, bring it to awareness so you can see it, notice it, be aware of it, deal with it, heal it, love it, and release it and move on, all right? With that being said, Sag, hope you loved this channel message if you did don't forget to like this video thank you thank you thank you and let's dive into your tarot card for today god what is the most important message that sagittarius needs to hear about whenever they are watching this video as it's a timeless reading what's the most important message that sagittarius needs to hear about and needs to know what's your message for sag god all right So we have some kind of communication coming in, um, an offer, let's call it an offer. Someone's coming in to offer you something. There's an opportunity that's arising um, and Sad, you want to make sure that you're not too quick here to judge. You want to make sure you're not too quick to say no. You want to make sure that you don't have your guards up. You want to make sure you don't have your defenses up. It feels like there's something from your past, Sag, that's hiding within your subconscious. It feels like it's become a trigger. So when this communication comes in or when this offer comes in, you might be triggered by it where you might want to snap. You might want to make an impulse decision or say something impulsively or do something impulsively. So Sag, where in your life, where in your past is there impulsivity and, you know, where, what, what, what is this? What, place this in your life. Can you place this in your life, Saj? There's some form of trigger or defense mechanism that's disconnecting you from you and is disconnecting you from others and is disconnecting you from you and disconnecting you from God. So what is this, Saj? It's, it's a defense mechanism. It's um, a trigger. It's an unresolved trauma or issue or experience from the past that you're holding on to. Okay. Now, when this person comes in, this is someone that you can trust. This is an opportunity that you can trust. Um, it's, it's an emotional opportunity. It's going to make you happy. And, you know, it's, it's coming from a kind person. It's coming from a genuine person here. But there's something about your past that you might be triggered where you might be abruptly, you know, impulsively saying something without thinking, doing something before thinking, something along those lines, okay, Saj? So this is something that you want to avoid at all cost because what's coming in for you is something good, okay? 
Obviously, this can be anything for any of you, so you always want to follow your intuition first and foremost at all given point in times. Follow your intuition, follow your heart, follow your gut. However, Sag, you don't want to pursue and react to what's coming in to you and what's coming in for you, you don't want to react to it from a past trigger from that vantage point, okay? You want to heal that past trigger, that trauma or that experience, you want to bring it up to light, bring it to awareness, see it for what it is, love it, hear it out, feel it and then release it, surrender it, let it go and allow this beautiful opportunity and this person come in for you with love, okay Saj? Hope that resonates. We love you ever so much. Until the next time, bye for now.